17 unbelievable items sent by post. 17. Escape Artist This is definitely one of the more unusual items to be posted. A human being. And it was done to escape a lifetime of slavery. Henry Brown said he had a vision and he followed through with it. March 29, 1849. With the help of a friend, Brown packed himself into a wooden crate and had himself shipped to an abolitionist, James Miller McKim. And he arrived 27 hours later. Unfortunately, this saw the introduction of the Fugitive Slave Act in 1849. 1850. And had he just kept quiet about it, others could have made a similar escape. 16. Everything has a price. But I doubt you would have felt comfortable posting a 45.42 carat diamond through the regular postal service. However, that's exactly what a New York jeweler did once. Harry Winston had the diamond insured for quite a lot of money and he posted it for a mere $2. It arrived safe and sound. 15. Cost-Effective Method It was 1916 when William Colthorpe decided to build a bank in Utah using bricks. However, the bricks he wanted were 127 miles away. So what was the most cost-effective way to get the bricks to Utah? By post, of course. So 80,000 bricks later, he received his entire bank posted by US Mail. The postal service delivered everything as required, but it did prompt them to limit the daily weight allowed to be posted posted per person per day. 14. Oh dear. While there are many unusual stories as to why certain items were posted, some reasons we will never know. Like the dear tibia that was once picked up by the US Postal Service. This still made it to its destination. 13. Perfectly legal Although you can't send things like copious amounts of bricks anymore, did you know that it's perfectly legal to post bees, chickens, scorpions and even fish? Aren't you glad you don't have to deal with these crazy deliveries at the postal service? Apparently, Gold Star mails 300 packaged bees every single spring. 12. Special delivery And this time, it's not from the stalk, but from the postal service. Did you know that it used to be legal to post children? It was 1913 when the postal system began in the US. And of course, like anything, people pushed the boundaries as to what was able to be posted. A Mr. and Mrs. Boge realized it was cheaper to post their kid to the granny than to buy him a rail ticket. So that's what they did. It cost them 15 cents for the stamps, they insured him for $50, and he arrived safely. It was soon outlawed, however, not before another baby was posted to his grandma. Not too long ago, a mom actually tried to ship her daughter from a school trip who was feeling really homesick. 11. The lengths a mother will go. I really can't see the logic behind this, but a mom literally trying to post a steaming hot shepherd's pie to her son, who lived a mere 450 miles away. 10. A proper burial. What do you do when your beloved cat passes away and you're miles and miles from home? You post it back home, of course. A Yorkshire couple wanted to give their cat a proper burial and couldn't keep the cat with them as it would decompose. So, the quickest way to get it home was to post it. 9. Are you listening? Celebrities are definitely used to receiving strange things in the mail, like Emma Watson who received a copious number of Bibles after appearing in the Harry Potter movies, and Jared Leto who received a severed ear. He said it was an entire ear with a note saying, Are you listening? Leto put a hole in the ear and wore it as a necklace. Sounds like the most obvious thing to do. 8. Hey, Spud! Reddit user Kevlar Yamulka received a most unusual pass once, which resulted in around 1,500 comments from Reddit users. So what would cause so many people to react to a package? Well, because he had received an unpackaged potato. Apparently, this is one of the many things that you can post in the USA without even packaging it. Just pop a stamp onto the potato, write the details on with the marker, and you're all set to post it. 7. Return to sender You might not want to if you received this accidentally. A student in the States ordered a pretty ordinary weightlifting bench online. He was rather surprised to receive two packages addressed to him. And when he opened the second one, well, he was even more surprised. He found a $300,000 drone inside. The drone ended up belonging to the National Oceanic and Atmospheric Administration. And no one knows how that drastic error occurred. 
6. Love the drive You would imagine that people who purchase a camper van love driving and traveling, but not this unusual couple from the UK. The couple were keen to explore the south coast, but both hated driving the camper van. So they had the van transported there on the back of a lorry, where they reluctantly continued their journey in the van. 5. Summer Vibes Want to be a bit more unique the next time you write to someone? Do it on a flip-flop. In the USA, posting a flip-flop is totally okay. As long as you have your stamps and address on, it will arrive where you need it to arrive. 4. Testing the Limits some scientists and pranksters from a magazine called Improbable Research made it their mission to see what they could get away with posting. They sent many different items.